day. Well, this morning, a local mother diagnosed with breast cancer is explaining how her two positive diagnoses actually changed her life. Mm -hmm. and Stephanie Sona tells us Morgan Fernandez wants her story to encourage other women to do self-examinations and go to the doctor when something feels wrong. I was um, doing my normal breast checks and I found a lump and scared me. It has been over a year since Morgan Fernandez was diagnosed with her two positive breast cancer. Her journey led to six rounds of chemotherapy, two surgeries, and immunotherapy treatment. I was shocked initially because um, I was 40 years old. I didn't have any medical problems in the past. I was, um, I have two young kids, and so it was scary. Morgan had never heard of her two positive breast cancer. According to the American Cancer Society, HER2 is a protein that helps breast cancer cells grow quickly, and it only impacts about 15 to 20 percent of all breast cancers. The HER2 positive in the, in the past was um, kind of like a death sentence um, until they've come out with the immunotherapy. In Morgan's case, immunotherapy began for her shortly after she was diagnosed in September of last year. While undergoing treatment, she made the decision to have a double mastectomy with a flap reconstruction. The mastectomy part of the operation is does, done by a breast oncologist, a general surgeon. Um, that, that goal is to remove the cancer. And then the plastic surgeon's role after that is to reconstruct things. Morgan tells us that decision wasn't easy, but it was necessary. I still wanted to feel like a woman and I didn't want the cancer to come back. Morgan is set to finish her immunotherapy treatment in November. After that, she will need to take medications for five years and get checked by her medical oncologist every three to six months. While long road ahead, Morgan wants other women to know the importance of self-examinations and how they can help with an early diagnosis. I feel like that is super important because you know your body better than anyone else. It's best to catch things early and you can only do that by appropriate screening. With Stephanie Serna, KSAT 12 News.